Well, after watching the film, it was confirmed that, uh, you know, a harsh character of the football team was revealed on, on Saturday. We were a tough football team and mentally and physically. We had lots of guys getting nicked up during the course of the game and then managed to get themselves back in the football game. And uh, just all the things that occurred throughout the course of that game showed you how tough we've become being down 13 points at the beginning and then going down in the fourth quarter again and having to fight our way back into the football game and, and make some plays at the end to win the football game was, I think that was very important for this football program as a whole. And, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's nice to have a group of seniors the way we have who have provided leadership all year and have provided the glue for us to stay together through some tough times. And I thought as a, as a team, we matured throughout the course of the season. And you could actually see the maturation happen on Saturday right before your eyes. So it was a, it's a great, great win for this program and gives us a chance to play for something uh, on uh, Friday. Well, it does so much for you. I think it gives you a lot of confidence going into the off season. Uh, it's, but for me, it's it's about the seniors. You know, if we can provide a six and six season after the start start we've had, uh, it tells me a lot about the seniors and what they're all about. So to me, that's where it starts. What about the history you have? What would it mean to you to finish season six and six? Um, it would mean everything. You know, I, um, since we've been here, five and seven is the best I ever had. So um, you know, six and six would, would would mean a lot. Like Coach said, um, the way we started off the season. Um, coming back and, and fighting hard and, and, you know, winning the last five would be, you know, everything to this team because, you know, it it, uh, it, it was showed how hard we worked, you know, throughout these last five games and through the offseason. So finish 6-6 six six would be a great deal. Yeah, hopefully uh, last year, we helped them out last year. So, you know, hopefully they'll help us out this year. Like I said, it would mean a lot. You know, our goal at the beginning of the season was to win, you know, MAC East and go on to play for the um, MAC Championship. But, you know, um, now that, that can't happen, but we could at least have a share of that title. Well, I think it's big for the program. I mean, it's uh, those are things that haven't been done here in a long, long time. And uh, for us to be able to do that, to accomplish that, especially when everyone counted us out five weeks ago. There's a lot of doubters, uh, but inside the locker room, the people who counted made the difference. And uh, so to be able to come back and say that, that would be huge for the program. Coach Hazel and um, the rest of the coaches, they built that into us in the off season. November periods and uh, different zip periods. And those are periods that, that build mental toughness and, and um, you know, teach you how to deal with adversity. And during Saturday's game, we faced a lot of adversity. Uh, first of all, being down 13-0, and um, also being down late in the fourth quarter. You know, usually, um, you know, teams uh, from Kent State would have, would have folded, but you know, with the senior leadership and the leadership with Coach Hazel, and you know, the off-season training with November periods, um, confidence was instilled that you know, we we will be able to come back. You know, even though early in the season. You know, we were down and faced adversity, and we weren't able to come back. Those November periods helped us to, you know, come back during late games. Two years ago, we will be looking for, you know, someone to make a play. And I think on Saturday, you know, like Coach said, guys showed toughness. Three or four guys were knocked out the game and ended up coming back in. And those guys who were knocked out ended up coming up and making big plays for us. You know, and I was just, I just think that, you know, different from two years ago that, Guys were making plays. They weren't sitting around making for, waiting for someone else to make a play. Just watching Temple, I've watched their all their special teams. I've watched all of their defense, and uh, a very tough football team again, uh, just like Eastern Michigan was. Uh, play a lot of man coverage defensively, so we're going to have to beat man coverage. Uh, but they have a couple key players that are difference makers. Uh, they're running backs. 30 and 22 are dynamic guys. And 22 especially, he's a guy with tremendous balance, quickness, strong, returns punts, returns kicks. He uh, worries me a little bit, so we're going to have to do a good job of containing that guy. He's a very explosive guy. Uh, but they're a good football team, um, and they're playing well. 
played Army last week, which, you know, you go into a game against one of the academies and you know you're going to get chopped all day, cut blocks, and but they handled it extremely well.